three, two. Hey guys, welcome back to Shin to Shin. I'm Michael. And I'm Andrew. And today we are making Korean burritos. Yeah, so uh, like Korean style sushi burritos. So we thought we'd have uh, a little fun for this episode. And um, one thing I like to eat, if you've ever seen it before or had it before, it's, it's become kind of popular in the last few years, making sushi, uh, but making even larger, is so it's sort of like the size of a burrito. So, um, you know, it's gonna be, uh, if you've seen our uh, Korean kimbap uh, video before, it's gonna be quite similar. Uh, we're gonna use uh, the dry seaweed sheets to um, roll our rice in with all our ingredients, uh, but we're gonna make it, like I said, the size of a burrito. Mm -hmm. Are you excited? Okay, so Michael, do you want to list off the ingredients for uh, our viewers at home? Yeah. Please subscribe to our channel and hit the notification button so you can get notified and look at all of our newest videos that we make. And thank you for your support. So the ingredients that we'll be using is edamame. Yeah, edamame. Um, bean sprouts. Bean sprouts. Your That's our, our <laughs> secret, not so yeah. secret uh, hot sauce, which is really equal parts sriracha, honey, and uh, Japanese mayo, or you can use regular mayo, and um, a little bit of garlic powder or, uh, or some onion powder if mm -hmm. you want as well. Uh, dried seaweed sheets. Yep. Sesame oil. Sesame oil, yep. Uh, two eggs. Yep. Salt and pepper. Sesame seeds. Carrots. Yellow radish pickle. Mm hmm. Yeah, or um, daikon radish. Yeah, red onion. Yep. Uh, fake crab meat. Yeah, your favorite. Yeah, what is it? <laughs> Enoki mushrooms. Enoki mushrooms. And, and, and we've made this many times before bulgogi. in various. Yeah, bulgogi. And we have the rice. Yeah, of course, we'll be using rice as well. Um, so a little bit about the ingredients, uh, the enoki mushroom, what we're going to do with this is just pan fry a little bit um, with some uh, oil, uh, salt and pepper, mm -hmm. and then we'll use that as an ingredient within our um, sushi burrito. Yeah. Bulgogi, uh, we've made this many times before, and we'll put a link to our video on how to, how to make bulgogi, but it's your standard uh, soy sauce based uh, marinade. With the eggs, what we're going to do is scramble the eggs and then do an egg roll on the frying pan and then slice them up thin. So then again, like we did in our kimbap video, use that as an ingredient for when we put it together. So let's get started. Yeah. What do you say, Michael? Oh, by the way, do you like our t-shirts? Or uh, have our Star Wars theme going on today with a little bit of Darth Vader action? Cool. Okay, let's get ready, Michael. Mm -hmm. doing a great job okay I think this is more than enough enoki mushroom that we mm -hmm. need uh, so we don't need to use all of this and I think we're ready to go so next step is we're going to pan fry the enoki mushrooms lightly and of course our bulgogi mm -hmm. we gotta uh, cook that once those two ingredients are cooked then we'll be ready to put together our sushi burritos mm -hmm. oh yes <laughs> and the eggs so, let me get on that. Our pepper. Huh? Are you eating the ingredients? Don't eat all of it. All right, now we're ready to cook. Okay, so we're ready to pan fry the, uh, the enoki mushrooms. We're gonna do that, like I said, lightly with mm -hmm. some cooking oil. I'm going to make our egg roll. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of oil here. And Michael, you can start adding the enoki mushrooms. Yeah. Don't 
So I use this too. Yep. So what you want to do is once you sprinkle on some salt and pepper okay. over that, okay, and then I'll start the egg. And actually, we'll probably need another plate so we can put our mushrooms on there once they're gone. Yep, you can take it off the pan oh. and put it on yep, the plate there. Don't, yep. Actually, let's take it off the frying pan like that. More of the mushrooms there. We'll turn the heat down a little, put it on medium. Just that? Yep. So now we're going to cook our pulgogi. Yeah. Yep. So we're ready to uh, do our final steps on some of our ingredients here. So we have our egg roll. And all I'm going to do here is just cut it. Yep. Just kind of thin slices like this. And you can see they sort of unravel. As we did for our kimbab, we can just kind of use these as strips, right? Good, Justin. And I'm also going to cut up our pulgogi. Mm -hmm. So all we're going to do is really just cut. It is? It's still hot. Why is your hands not burning? Hmm? That's it. It's assembly time. So Michael, you're going to use um, the, oh. the bamboo uh, sushi roller. Yeah. As you can see, we have our dried seaweed sheet uh, positioned lengthwise. So what we're going to do is we have our rice here. Uh, we've taking it out of the rice cooker to let it cool because you don't want it too hot. You want about room temperature. Make it a little easier to uh, use. Yeah, work with. Mm. So Michael is saying, well, just be careful. We want to be careful not to press too hard uh, to the point where, it, yeah, we don't want the uh, this dried seaweed sheet to uh, rip apart. a little bit of rice here on this one. Yeah, I think so. And then you can add your ingredients. So what do you want to add for yours? Of course, the fake crab meat. Yep. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe one more piece of crab meat because you like it. Mm, carrots. Yes. Yeah. You want some red onions? Sure. Then, you know, it goes on. Do you want any edamame? Do you want sprouts? I never tried these. Try one, eat it. <laughs> Not quite. Okay. Maybe some. I'll just do that. Do you want any egg or no? I'll have one egg. And do you want pulgogi? Some pulgogi. A little bit? Okay. I don't like the, I don't, it doesn't, I don't like the taste but nothing. Oh, you know what we forgot? What? Kimchi. Oh, should we get it? Yeah, we could put kimchi okay. in as a topping. You want to bring it out from the fridge? Sure. And some kimchi. We got some kimchi. Homemade kimchi, and, right? Okay, is that good? That's a, Okay, that's do you want any of the not-so-secret hot sauce? A little bit, drizzle? Hmm, sure. Oh. Yeah. You remember how to roll it? Yeah, So I've what you it. want to do is... Uh, Keep it as tight as possible. Holy moly, I don't even know if I can okay. one bite it or like... Do you want to finish rolling it? Keep rolling it? Yep. 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 That's good. Oh my. These smoke. That's like a... I don't even know if I can finish this. Okay. Okay. It's so massive. Yeah, it is. Well... You know, when you eat a burrito, it's like this too, right? I don't even know if I can. Okay, so leave that for now. Wow, I'm going to make one for your brother, Mark. That's insanely big. Okay, so Mark has let us know what he wants in his. 
He said some crab meat, um, some eggs, yeah. What is this again? Edamame. He wanted some carby as well, right? Yeah. Are you gonna help? Yeah. I'll just spread some. Mm -hmm. uh, for a second, I thought those were green beans. He wanted some red onions, right? Yeah. He didn't want any kimchi. No, and not the sauce. Right. Did you want anything else? Carrots, right? Do you want do you want sprouts? No. No? Anything else? No. Okay. Who? Mark? Yeah. He said No. I think he said crab. No, he said actually no. Well, it's gonna be surprise. Surprise. Well he probably can And finally Yours? Mine. Alright, now to put ingredients in for my sushi burrito. I'm gonna start off with bulgogi. I'm not sure how I'm going to fit all these ingredients in here because I think I want everything. Mm -hmm. I got my egg. And I'm, I'm eating even more of me on the side. <laughs> You're not going to be uh, able to eat your sushi burrito if you keep eating all the ingredients. No key mushrooms. I that, don't know. That looks delicious. I don't know if someone would be able to eat all of this. I'm not going to use as much of the yellow radish, the di uh, daikon. Yellow daikon. Definitely going to have some sprouts. And these sprouts were simply just steamed. Kimchi. Kimchi for sure. A little bit of crab meat. Oh my gosh, look at this. This thing look, is huge. It's already big. Definitely gonna have some edamame. You're putting everything in, I think. I am, I know. On the outside, we're gonna use the sesame. Definitely of red onions. Oh, wait. Kimchi. Oh my gosh. And last but not least, Our secret. not so secret hot sauce. Yeah. I love this. It's like a, your signature hot sauce. Like yeah, sauce. my signature hot sauce. Time to roll it. I think. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I don't think you can. I can even roll this thing. Oh my. God. So full. Uh, jumbo size rolls. Wow. Holy okay. God. Yours is the biggest. Yeah. So what we're going to do is cut them in half and then we'll be ready to eat. So final step for my sushi burrito, I said uh, I want to lightly brush some sesame oil on the outside here because I, I like the flavor. Helen's not a big fan, so if she were to have it, she wouldn't. Um, and you can have a little bit of sesame seeds. Great. Then I'm going to cut mine. And <laughs> look at that. So, Michael, how do you think they turned out? They turned out really well. It looks pretty good, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, so, I'm ready to dig in. I know I you are. Too. We gave Mark his sushi burrito. Uh, do you want to take yours? You can put it on a plate. Yeah. And I'll just eat off the big plate. Look at this. Jumbo oh my. Size yeah, plate jumbo size jumbo plate. Look at this. That looks... Definitely looks like a sushi burrito. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Moment of truth. How is it? I think I took too big a bite. It's good. How do you like it? Mm. It's yummy, right? All the ingredients in there. Good mix of flavors. Thick rice on the side. Yeah. <laughs> and the sauce is good. Mm -hmm. If it's falling apart. Mm -hmm. And it's a burrito, it's gonna be messy. I bit my tongue. <laughs> Did you? Because you're so hungry. I'm just surprised that it's like that good. It's good and messy. Look at this. It's falling apart, mine. Hmm? Call you Mark. I'm <laughs> I'm the time. I mix up you and Mark. Mm -hmm. You know who mixes us a lot? Mom. Mm. All right. On to the second half. <laughs> Michael, you're still finishing the first half. Do you think you're going to finish all of it? Probably not, eh? Well, we can give that half to Mom. I'm sure she'll enjoy it. All right. Digging in. 
I don't know why you can eat it all, you know why? What? You're, you look more hungry than me. Mm-hmm. And you're taking way more bigger bites. Oh, yeah. Hot sauce has a little bit of kick. I can't even taste it. Because I mostly taste just mm. all the I didn't other put stuff. too much in yours. No, you didn't. Mm -hmm. Look, it's only here. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Finish it off in one bite? For me, no. no me. For you, yeah. Because <laughs> I have a big mouth? Yeah. Mmm. Well, Michael, I am stuffed. Me too. <laughs> you are, right? I think the half was big enough for you. Um, but mom said she'll gladly eat the other half. I know Mark is enjoying his sushi burrito. Mm -hmm. I got to say, this was really fun to make. Mm -hmm. Did you enjoy it? Yeah. I had a lot of fun making it. Those of you watching at home, I uh, hope you enjoyed this episode of Shin to Shin with our Korean style sushi burrito. Uh, hopefully you'll try it at home as well. Let us know, you know, if you enjoy it. And as always, you know, we appreciate the support and, wa and watching our videos. Uh, we recently just surpassed 150, 150 subscribers. So, I think we're actually close to 160 now. We're like 158, 159 or so. So again, we continue to get new subscribers. We really appreciate everyone who watches and supports us. And, um, you know, our stats tell us that 80% of the people who watch aren't subscribed. So if you are watching this and you aren't subscribed, hit the sub, uh, subscribe button. We would uh, really appreciate that. And uh, you can continue to get the latest updates when we release new videos. Yeah, also we're trying to reach our goal to 200 now, so mm -hmm. you guys should subscribe. <laughs> Awesome. So guys, yeah, thanks again for uh, watching this episode of Shin to Shin, our uh, Korean style sushi burrito. Uh, remember to also check us out on social media and Instagram at Shin to Shin uh, and TikTok as well from time to time we post there. And uh, until next time, uh, we'll see you again soon with another video. Yep. Goodbye. Bye.